All right, guys, how you doing? Welcome to Paint with Lovejoy. I'm going to go over how I varnish my acrylic paintings. And this is completely optional. This is just how I do it. So your supplies that I use, are my acrylic painting, my varnish, I use gloss and matte, and then a large flat brush or a foam brush. Now my first layer of varnish, I actually use the gloss. I personally don't like the gloss, but because I lay that as my first layer, when I put the matte varnish on top of it in the next couple of layers, anytime that I can see shiny spots, that tells me that I missed a spot on my second and third layers. So that's why I use the gloss varnish for the first layer. If you happen to like gloss varnish or you want the satin finish or semi-gloss, feel free to use that. And I do recommend at least two to four layers of varnish. And you do want to let them fully dry in between each layer. And again, the gloss, the matte, the semi-gloss uh, semi or satin finish is completely personal choice. I just like the gloss at the beginning for the first layer. And then I'll do a second layer with the matte finish. And it helps me, uh, helps show that I have covered the entire space. So you can even see here where it's already pretty shiny. And now I'm going to be moving to the matte varnish. And I did move up to a bigger brush just to demonstrate that you can use a couple of different brushes as you do this. If you happen to be on a textured, a lot of texture on your uh, painting, try to make sure that your brush goes in all different directions because you want every surface, every area, every little peak, you do want that covered in your varnish. And the varnish does help protect a painting. Um, should something happen to it, spill on top of it, it's just going to be touching the varnish layers and not the actual paint layers. And again, this is for acrylic painting. There's a slightly different method and materials, um, similar application if you're going to be doing uh, varnishing an oil painting. So here you can see that owl is already pretty matte finish. And this is another one. And this is showing the places where it's shiny that I missed the matte finish. So again, that's why I like putting the glossy varnish down first and then following up with a matte finish and this one will get just another layer just to make sure that I covered all of it and it leaves that nice kind of matte finish and I like the matte finish just because it doesn't have that reflection like you can see on the owl painting um, compared to when it has the gloss so again your style of varnish finish is totally personable personal to you so have fun with f varnishing your acrylic paintings. And if you have any extra questions, feel free to leave a comment. Happy painting.